Welcome back. March is Women's History Month, and all this month we're celebrating some of Colorado's finest. The 10 women being inducted this year into the Colorado Women's Hall of Fame. This morning, a woman who may be familiar to longtime Coloradans, former Lieutenant Governor Gail Schotler. Here's Denver 7's Andrew Trujillo. Hi, I'm Gail Schettler. Hi. Hope you'll go. Back in 1998, Gail Shetler was the first woman to ever be on the Colorado governor's ballot. And I loved politics. I really, I realized that that's where you make decisions that affect people every single day of their lives. A former Douglas County School Board president and state treasurer, Gail has focused much of her career on finance, even helping found the Women's Bank back in 1978. Women have right to understand the world of finance. Women have a right to be successful. Women have a right to get promoted on merit. Gail continues to work on getting women elected to political office, founding the group Electing Women, and building upon the foundation set when she served as the first president of the International Women's Forum. They focus on different kinds of issues. It's not about building your military or going to war. It's about negotiation. It's about education. It's about health care. And most of all, she lets women know they can accomplish anything they set their mind to. I want them to see that there are no barriers. I want them to understand that they can be successful, that they can do whatever they want to do, that the world is a wonderful and exciting and wide open place, and there are opportunities for girls and women everywhere. While Gail still lives here in Colorado, she also spends a lot of time helping run her family's ranch in California. You can read more about Gail Shedler and the other nine women being inducted into the Colorado Women's Hall of Fame later this month right now on the DenverChannel.com.